reporter Doris Burke. This is Kevin Hart. They're just off a road trip in the heat and looking to settle back. What's going on, folks? It's Kate Spade and Prospect. Back today with a brand new Miami Heat NBA 2K16 My GM video. Folks, in today's video, I got my Miami Heat at home. You know, we kind of rocking the Latin jerseys. That's one of them anyway. And we are doing battle against the Orlando Magic. Now, both of these teams are in Florida. Both of these teams are in the Eastern Conference, of course. Both of these teams are trying to right their wrongs and trying to get back on the top of the East, right? Orlando made a lot of moves in the offseason. Derek, boy. But check this out. I played great defense. They got it back to him and let him shoot again by the time I was already in his head. Orlando made a lot of moves in the offseason, man. They brought over Bismack Biombo. Hold up. Rainmaker, boy. Still got the burner. Bosh is starting the game shooting from deep. Let's go. I like how we started this game, team. I like that. Uh, for some odd reason, I have to reset after basket cuts, shot feedback, and shot me that every game it doesn't save for me. I don't know what I did wrong, but it don't save. Anyway, even though we didn't really make big moves in the offseason, we made our moves during the season. Both teams still, though. They showing the effort to try to get the team back to glory days. You know, Orlando had their trip to the finals back when they had Penny Hardaway and Shaquille O'Neal. And Miami Heat, man, our trips to the finals are well documented. You know what I'm saying? We get it in. Both teams are trying to get back. I kind of like this whole battle for the best team in Florida thing. I like that. I like a nice little rivalry. But today these guys are down here in Miami, and I don't feel like we should lose at home. Now, I told you we had some issues when I – Bosh, you should have sprayed up on that fool. Oh, I like that too. That's the old school way of doing it. Okay, I like that. Just put it on the ground, and, you know, buy slow to death in this game. Put it on the ground, go buy him, get the easy bucket. But, yeah, man, I like the team that we finally settled on. Not only do I have a pretty good unit as far as the way they play, they get along, and I think they nice. Like, I like this squad. Now, I'm still learning some of these guys. Jump shot timing. In the last video, after the sim was applied, you guys saw TJ Warren shot 100%. Y'all was like, Spade, you should have shot more with him. I should have. You guys have. Absolutely right. So this is my opportunity to find out who is hot this game and make the adjustments on the fly. That's what I got to do a better job of. Anyway, get to the game, yo. After that wonderful start, we came out the gate on fire. At some point, we let off the gas. We slowed up, and Orlando was right there. Like, they running, trying to get back in the game. And that's exactly what happened. Now we somewhat got a competitive game. Check us out. And I'm playing more on-ball defense. Shout out to the homie. I don't have your name, but I'll probably throw your comment or something in the video. Like, Spade, are you going to ever play on-ball defense? Fam, I used to always play on-ball defense, but the computer would just kill you with the off-ball screens. And your computer players can never get there. So that's why I play a lot of off-ball. But what I'm going to do is try to switch to the guy who's about to get picked. You kind of got to watch the whole court. See who's about to get picked. Switch to that guy because they ain't got no sense. D-Book going to the basket with the runner. Getting it to go. Every time Orlando gets close, watch out a little bit. We hit him with a stiff arm. Boop, stiff arm. Right in the face. Knock him out the way, yo. And they are competing. Like, they trying to get back into the game. I can dig it. But we right here. Serge, you know Serge got a pretty nice perimeter jumper. He all right. He got a good look right here. Cashed it out. You see what I'm saying? They right here in the review. So we catch him sleeping. Bosh don't beat everybody back down the court. Quick pass, quick shot, easy deuce. I mean, why complicate it? Why take a difficult shot when Bosh is cooking like he is? Bosh came out the gate inspired today. I don't know. You know what somebody said to Bosh, but he's on fire. Check me out here, man. Great look for Book. Couldn't get it. We got him a second look. Couldn't get that one either. So you know what that is? That's karma because I was trolling uh, old boy early in the first quarter when he had two great looks. He got the first one blocked. I guess the first one wasn't that great. He got the first one blocked, then he missed the second one. I trolled him. It came back to bite me in the ass, so to speak. Big time three for Orlando. They tied it up briefly. We're trying to pull it back off. Two-point game. Check me out. I'm trying to play on-ball defense. Of course, it's just picks on picks on picks. But we got defense for days. Beautiful block shot. The camera turn kind of messed your boy up right there. But beautiful dime. TJ Warren cutting to the basket. The commentators in this game said that he's one of the best at cutting to the basket. I don't know if that's true. Admittedly, I don't watch a lot of TJ Warren, but maybe they right. That's twice back to back that he cut to the basket and was rewarded with a beautiful pass. And he knew how to finish it. So, okay. I'll write that down on my mental notepad. TJ Warren, cut to the basket. Got gotcha. you. I got gotcha, you, fam. Got gotcha. you. Check us out right here, though. Darrell Wright. This dude right here has been a shooter in this league for years. 
You can call him a specialty player. You can call him a role player. What you better not do is give him a decent look from beyond the arc because he will cash it out, as you can see. Monte Ellis, this is our score off the bench. If we was the Clippers, Monte Ellis is our Jamal Crawford. He comes off the bench. He gives the second unit a spark. Great find right here. Darrell was fading. It still don't matter. Rainmaker. Boy, so far, just tearing hell wrong with them. Let's get it cracking. Five point inside. game, man. Bosch is somewhat slowed down, not because he stopped scoring, because we kind of stopped getting him to rock. He really could probably do that every single time. I like Vooch, I like Ibaka, I like Biombo, I like all them dudes, but honestly, they don't want no problems with Bosch. They don't want no problems with Bosch. Big time shot right here, trying to get Devin Booker going. I really wasn't shooting well with him. His release is quicker than I thought it was, too. So what I did, I was missing so many shots with D-Book. I told you guys I would work on doing a better job of adjusting on the fly. And that's what we did, man. We pulled him out the game. Anytime I was shooting bad with him, we put Monte Ellis in and we cooked with Monte. So I'll take that. Third quarter action, man. Orlando's still right behind us. If this was a drag strip, they kind of like on our back tight. You know, we just blow them out. They there. But they losing. Like if the race was to end right now, they in trouble. Still look at Bosch. Bosch ain't playing no games tonight, y'all. I see you, Bosch, and just think. The Wolfpack was telling me to trade you, fam. Can you believe that? They was telling me to trade you, Bosch. I got you. Whiteside, who's had a quiet night right here, tried to get what looked like an easy dime to D-Book. Book misses the shot, but he did stay with the shot. Got his own board, tried to go back up, got fouled again. Don't worry about it, Book. We got you. We get you two at the charity strike. I got to do better, yo. Big time block for us. Of course, we will save it back to Orlando. Serge would knock down the midi. I see you, Serge. I see you on my back tire, fam. That ain't going to get you no trophy, though. Like, finishing the race on my back tire is not going to get you a dub. Y'all got to make a move at some point. You got to. White side, back to the basket, kicking it over to Bosch. I like when the big men work together. Big man to big man assist. I like that. I love it, actually. Big time stuff, y'all. Seven point game when Bosch kicks it out to D Book. You know I wasn't trying to throw it to him. I really wanted to hit Tyson Chandler in the first place, but direction pass so trash. I eventually got it to him. Easy basket. If you can get easy baskets, why do anything else? Look at Bosch. Bosch ain't playing no games, y'all. He really not. Bosch is angry. This is Toronto Bosch. Y'all done pissed this dude off. Anyway, folks, we almost got a double digit lead on these guys late in the third. Third quarter, I don't know why you saw it the other day in my New York Knicks video. In the third quarter, I tend to, I don't know. We come out the gate kind of nice. I seem to put it together. What I've noticed about me is I start slow. I do pretty good around the middle of the game. And I don't know if the CPU gets a boost late in the game or if I just play trash late in the game. But it's always a run late. As you can see, we was up. What, nine points? And we let him go on a bit of a run. Even right here. Great ball movement. Jeff Green got a jumper. He shows it right here. Cashes out the Rainmaker. It is a two-point game. We was just up damn near double digits, yo. How does this happen to me every time? I don't know. It do. But it's all good. We, we'll be all right. 14 seconds left in the quarter. I want a high percentage shot if I can get one. Darrell Wright's got the burner. We know that. I get it back to Monte. Monte is calling for a screen. Three, two, one. Just throw it up, Monte. Rainmaker, boy. The hell is wrong with these dudes, fam? Monte said, I got the burner. I'm triggered up, man. They call him strapped up shawty. Big time shot, man. Five point game going into the fourth. I feel real good about this. I, I really do. Now, I know I can squander a lead. I squander a lead with the best of them. But I feel good about what my team is showing me out here. Legit. Jeff T, slow the tempo down, T. We good, fam. And we're Trying to run this play for TJ. TJ also has a pretty good shot. We've seen that. And I, I don't know what was going on here. I guess he was trying to set up the screen. When I finally got it to him, of course I pull. Why not? We sit here and wait at all that time for him to run that. When you run the play, I'm going to make him shoot. We cash that out. Folks, it's a six-point game. Two three-pointers if they want to shoot from outside. And I feel like they wanted to go outside, but instead they kept settling for going to the basket. Only problem is, Hassan Whiteside in there. Hassan ain't playing that. It's a lot he can't do. That's the one thing I'm sure he can do. Very confident in that. My boy Jeff T was diamond, yo. Like Damian Lillard in that lame commercial where he be dropping dimes. Yes, it was like that for real. Teague was doing a great job of setting teammates up. 
I don't feel Teague. like 2K made Teague as fast as he really is. I would like to see they Teague be faster. I see you. I see you. Nice little move. I see you, fam. I ain't even going to hate. He, he kind of, you know, that's your boy going the wrong way a little bit right there. It's all good, though. Once again, we got him on the ropes. Almost double digits. D-Book is going to cash that one out right there. That officially puts us over a double digit lead. Well, over 10. Let me say that. I don't know if it could be over a double. That would be a triple digit lead. And I don't think that's ever happened. But you know what I'm talking about. I thought that was great defense. Bosch runs out, hands up, Ibaka. Now, I know he can shoot a little bit, but hold up. Who is this, Harder? Great ball movement again. Fournier can't get the shot to fall. We get the board. They got a foul. Get off my back, fam. You got the whistle already. Chill, you know? Of course, I'm going to inbound the ball to Devin Booker. He's got like an 86 free throw rating. He's got a pretty easy shot. I can time it well. It's absolutely no reason for anybody else to touch the rock down the stretch. And we're going to let Book take us home, man. We draw the curtains on Orlando. These guys came. They fought. But ultimately, they still went home with an L, fam. Like, I guess you get a, a consolation prize by saying that you fought. But you still got beefed up. You still got faded. On the scoreboard, it says it's a three-point lead. I mean, a three-point win until I apply to Sam. It's going to change a little bit. But once again, the scoreboard is a little closer than the real game was. We really beat their ass, for real, for real. Look at Bosch, 34-8. and eight. Booker had 24 points, and 12 of those was at the charity strike. That's all I got for today. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, as always, man, I only got one request. Just bang the like button if you're a regular here. If you new here, I'm asking you to subscribe, man. You got to become a member of my Wolfpack. That's what I call my supporters. They the best supporters in the whole wide world. I don't see no reason for you to not be one, too. I'm out the next time, folks. Peace.